Marcus Aurelius once said, the soul becomes dyed with the color of its thoughts. Every idea, every flicker of curiosity shapes who you become. Imagine becoming a version of yourself that's sharper, more insightful, and filled with newfound wisdom. This isn't a distant dream, but a tangible reality. In this video, you'll discover 10 powerful stoic techniques to elevate your intelligence. Embrace this opportunity to explore every facet of your mind and its boundless potential. If you're passionate about personal growth, take a moment to hit that notification bell and subscribe. Let's embark on a journey to a wiser you. 1. Embracing change as a teacher. Change is an inevitable part of life. Seasons shift, technology advances, and even our favorite snacks might get a new recipe. While many of us resist change, fearing the unknown or the loss of what's familiar, the Stoics saw change as a natural part of life and a profound teacher. Every time you've grown, hasn't it been due to change? Moving to a new city, starting a new job, or even reading a book that shifts your perspective. All these changes push us out of our comfort zones and challenge us to adapt. This adaptation sharpens our intelligence and resilience. Marcus Aurelius once said, Loss is nothing else but change, and change is nature's delight. This perspective is empowering. Instead of viewing change as a loss, we can see it as an opportunity to learn, adapt, and grow. Embracing change doesn't mean recklessly chasing every new trend or constantly upending our lives. It's about developing a flexible mindset and understanding that change whether big or small, is an opportunity to learn something new. Approach change with curiosity rather than fear, and you'll continuously expand your knowledge and understanding. Consider the nature of change in your own life. Think back to significant moments when change seemed daunting, but ultimately led to personal growth. Perhaps it was a career shift that required learning new skills a move to a new place that broadened your cultural horizons, or a personal transformation that reshaped your values and beliefs. Each of these experiences, though initially challenging, contributed to your development, enhancing your intelligence and resilience. In the realm of personal development, embracing change means being open to new experiences and perspectives. It involves recognizing that our current knowledge and skills are not fixed, but can be expanded and refined. This mindset is crucial for lifelong learning and intellectual growth. When we resist change, we stagnate, but when we embrace it, we evolve. One practical way to embrace change is through continuous learning. This can be achieved by regularly seeking out new knowledge and experiences. For instance, you might commit to reading a new book each month, taking up a new hobby, or enrolling in a course that challenges your current understanding. By doing so, you expose yourself to new ideas and perspectives, broadening your intellectual horizons. 2. Embracing discomfort for growth. When we think of comfort, we often imagine a cozy bed, our favorite TV show, or a warm cup of cocoa on a cold day. But what if I told you that the path to true intelligence and wisdom often lies outside of this comfort zone? Stoicism, an ancient philosophy that has stood the test of time, teaches us that embracing discomfort can be a powerful tool for personal growth. Consider a challenging task like learning a new language or mastering a musical instrument. It's tempting to give up when things get tough or to avoid these challenges altogether. But the Stoics believed that it's precisely these moments of discomfort that offer the greatest opportunities for growth. By pushing through the unease and the struggle, we not only gain new skills, but also develop a resilience and mental toughness that can serve us in all areas of life. Marcus Aurelius once said, the obstacle is the way. This means that the very challenges and obstacles we face are not barriers to our growth, but rather the path itself. By reframing our mindset 
and viewing discomfort as an opportunity rather than a hindrance, we can harness its power to propel us forward. Think of stoic wisdom the next time you face a challenging task or uncomfortable situation. Embrace the discomfort and know that with each hurdle you overcome, you're not only becoming smarter, but also building a stronger, more resilient version of yourself. To truly understand the power of discomfort, let's delve into its impact on personal growth. When we avoid discomfort, we limit our experiences and stifle our potential. We remain in a state of complacency, missing out on opportunities to learn and grow. On the other hand, when we embrace discomfort, we open ourselves up to new experiences, challenges, and ultimately growth. One practical way to embrace discomfort is by setting challenging goals that push your boundaries. These goals should be realistic yet ambitious, requiring effort and perseverance to achieve. For example, if you're aiming to improve your physical fitness, set a goal to run a marathon. The training process will undoubtedly be uncomfortable, involving early mornings, sore muscles, and mental fatigue. However, the sense of accomplishment and the physical and mental growth you experience will be well worth the discomfort. Another approach is to intentionally seek out experiences that challenge you. This could be as simple as taking a different route to work, trying a new hobby, or engaging in a difficult conversation. By stepping outside your comfort zone regularly, you build a tolerance for discomfort and train your mind to see challenges as opportunities rather than threats. This mindset shift is crucial for personal growth and intelligence. Moreover, embracing discomfort requires a strong sense of self-discipline and perseverance. It's easy to give up when things get tough, but true growth happens when we push through the discomfort and keep going. Develop a routine that includes regular practices that challenge you, whether it's physical exercise, mental puzzles, or learning new skills. Consistency is key, and over time, you'll find that your capacity to handle discomfort increases. 3. The Practice of Deliberate Disengagement we often hear about the importance of engagement, engaging with our work, our studies, and our relationships. But what about the flip side? The Stoics recognize the immense value in deliberate disengagement, a purposeful step back from our usual routines and habits to refresh our perspectives and rejuvenate our minds. Imagine a painter who's been working on a piece for hours. Sometimes the best thing they can do to see the painting's true essence is to step back, take a break, and return with fresh eyes. Similarly, our minds benefit from periodic disengagement, allowing us to approach challenges with renewed vigor and clarity. Marcus Aurelius, in his introspective writings, noted, Men seek retreats for themselves, houses in the country, seashores and mountains. And you too are wont to desire such things very much. But this is altogether a mark of the most common sort of men, for it is in your power whenever you shall choose to retire into yourself. This stoic wisdom highlights that true retreat isn't about physical distance, but about finding space within ourselves, away from the constant pull of external demands. In today's hyper-connected era, the idea of disengaging might seem counterintuitive, yet it's more crucial than ever. It doesn't mean abandoning our responsibilities or shirking our duties. Instead, it's about setting aside intentional moments, be it a few minutes or a few days, to disconnect, reflect, and simply be. Deliberate disengagement can take many forms. It could be as simple as taking a walk without your phone, practicing deep breathing exercises, or dedicating a day to unplugged activities. These practices allow our minds to rest, recover, and gain new insights. When we return to our tasks, we do so with a fresh perspective, often finding solutions to problems that seemed insurmountable before. By practicing deliberate disengagement, we give our minds the space they need to process, learn, and grow. 
It's a counterbalance to the constant engagement of modern life, and in this balance we find a path to greater intelligence and deeper understanding. So, as you navigate the demands of today, remember the power of stepping back, if only for a moment, to rediscover clarity and purpose. 4. Maintaining Lifelong Learning The end of formal education, whether it be school or college, doesn't mark the end of learning. In fact, it's just the beginning. The Stoics believed that every day presents new opportunities to learn, grow, and refine our understanding of the world. This concept of lifelong learning isn't about amassing degrees or certifications. It's about nurturing a genuine curiosity and thirst for knowledge that lasts a lifetime. Think about a child's wonder when they encounter something new. Their eyes light up, questions pour out, and their imagination runs wild. As adults, it's easy to lose this sense of wonder amidst the responsibilities and routines of daily life. But what if we could reignite that spark? What if we approached each day with the same eagerness to learn and discover? Epictetus, with his profound simplicity, stated, Only the educated are free. At its core, this isn't just about formal education. It's about the freedom that comes from understanding, from broadening our horizons, and from continuously seeking knowledge. When we commit to lifelong learning, we equip ourselves with the tools to navigate the complexities of life with grace and wisdom. In today's digital age, the resources to learn are at our fingertips, from online courses to podcasts, from documentaries to interactive apps. The avenues to expand our knowledge are endless. However, lifelong learning isn't just about consuming content. It's about reflection, application, and sharing. It's about taking what we learn and weaving it into the tapestry of our lives, making us richer in thought and deeper in understanding. 5. Cultivating Gratitude as a Gateway to Wisdom At first glance, gratitude might seem like a fleeting emotion, something we experience momentarily when someone does something kind for us. However, the Stoics viewed gratitude in a much deeper, and more profound light. For them, gratitude was not just an emotion. It was a deliberate practice, a lens through which we could view the world, and a powerful gateway to wisdom and understanding. Gratitude encourages us to recognize the value in every moment, every interaction, and every challenge we face. When we practice gratitude, we become more attuned to the lessons that life offers, Instead of lamenting what we lack, we celebrate what we have, and in that celebration, we find clarity, perspective, and a deeper appreciation for the intricacies of life. Marcus Aurelius, one of the most revered Stoic philosophers, reflected on the importance of gratitude in his meditations. He wrote, When you arise in the morning, think of what a precious privilege it is to be alive, to breathe, to think, to enjoy, to love. This statement is more than a call to be thankful for another day. It is an invitation to approach each day with wonder, curiosity, and gratitude. By doing so, we open ourselves up to the countless lessons and insights that each moment holds. In today's fast-paced world, it's easy to get caught up in the race for more, more success, more possessions, more recognition. However, by cultivating a practice of gratitude, we ground ourselves in the present moment. We become more observant, more reflective, and more open to the wisdom that surrounds us. Whether it's the joy in a child's laughter, the lesson in a failed project, or the beauty in a sunset, gratitude amplifies our ability to see, learn, and grow. Gratitude also plays a crucial role in our mental and emotional well-being. Studies have shown that people who regularly practice gratitude experience greater levels of happiness, reduced stress, and improved physical health. By focusing on the positive aspects of our lives, 
we shift our mindset from one of scarcity to one of abundance. This shift not only enhances our emotional resilience, but also allows us to approach life's challenges with a more optimistic and constructive attitude. In the context of personal growth and intelligence, gratitude serves as a foundation for continuous learning. When we are grateful, we are more likely to recognize and appreciate the opportunities for growth that arise from difficult situations. Instead of viewing setbacks as failures, we see them as valuable learning experiences that contribute to our development. This perspective fosters a growth mindset, which is essential for lifelong learning and personal improvement. 6. The Power of Mindful Observation In the hustle and bustle of modern life, it's easy to overlook the simple yet profound act of mindful observation. This practice, deeply rooted in Stoic philosophy, invites us to pause, quiet our minds, and immerse ourselves fully in the present moment. Mindful observation is not merely about superficially glancing at our surroundings. It's about cultivating a deep awareness and appreciation for the intricacies of life. Imagine taking a moment to watch a leaf fluttering in the wind or observing the delicate patterns of frost on a window pane. These seemingly mundane experiences hold a wealth of knowledge and beauty when approached with mindful intent. By engaging in mindful observation, we move beyond passive observation to active participation in the world around us. Seneca, a prominent Stoic philosopher, once remarked, time discovers truth. This insight underscores the transformative power of mindful observation. When we dedicate ourselves to truly seeing and understanding our surroundings, we uncover truths about ourselves, others, and the world at large. We begin to discern patterns, make connections, and develop a deeper sense of empathy and interconnectedness. In today's fast-paced society, filled with screens and distractions, the practice of mindful observation may seem out of place. However, it is precisely in these quiet moments of observation that our minds can expand and our intelligence can flourish. Whether it's observing the rhythmic ebb and flow of waves on a beach, the bustling life of a city square, or the play of light through the leaves of a tree, each observation holds the potential to enrich our understanding of the world. Mindful observation is more than a passive exercise. It is a deliberate choice to engage with our surroundings with curiosity and reverence. It encourages us to slow down, take notice, and appreciate the beauty that surrounds us every day. In doing so, we cultivate a deeper connection to the present moment and a heightened awareness of the subtle nuances that shape our experiences. Practicing mindful observation also fosters a sense of gratitude and humility. By taking the time to observe and appreciate the world around us, we acknowledge our place within the larger tapestry of existence. We recognize the interconnectedness of all life and gain a renewed appreciation for the wonders of nature, human creativity, and the boundless possibilities of the universe. 7. The Art of Active Listening In a world dominated by noise and distractions, the art of active listening stands out as a cornerstone of genuine communication and profound understanding. Rooted in Stoic principles, active listening goes beyond merely hearing words. It involves fully engaging with others, seeking to comprehend their perspectives, and responding thoughtfully. This practice not only enhances our relationships, but also plays a crucial role in sharpening our intelligence and expanding our worldview. Imagine a conversation where, instead of waiting for your turn to speak, you listen attentively to every word, observe nonverbal cues, and genuinely try to grasp the speaker's thoughts and emotions. This is the essence of active listening, a deliberate act of empathy and curiosity. The Stoic philosopher Epictetus famously remarked, We have two ears and one mouth, so that we can listen twice as much as we speak. 
This aphorism encapsulates the Stoic belief in the value of listening as a pathway to wisdom and understanding. Active listening begins with setting aside our own preconceived notions and ego-driven impulses to respond. It requires us to be fully present in the moment, giving the speaker our undivided attention. By doing so, we not only honor their perspective, but also create a space for genuine connection and mutual respect to flourish. Furthermore, active listening fosters deeper insights and richer exchanges of ideas. When we listen actively, we gain access to a wealth of knowledge and experiences that may differ from our own. This diversity of perspectives broadens our understanding of complex issues, challenges our assumptions, and encourages critical thinking. In the words of Marcus Aurelius, the first rule is to keep an untroubled spirit. The second is to look things in the face and know them for what they are. In today's fast-paced world, where conversations often compete with digital distractions and fleeting attention spans, practicing active listening is more important than ever. It requires patience, empathy, and a willingness to suspend judgment, to truly seek to understand before seeking to be understood. By cultivating this skill, we not only strengthen our interpersonal relationships, but also nurture our intellectual growth and emotional intelligence. Active listening is not limited to formal settings or profound discussions. It can be applied to everyday interactions with friends, family, colleagues, and even strangers. Whether you're engaged in a heartfelt conversation, a brainstorming session at work, or a casual chat over coffee, the principles of active listening remain relevant. It involves asking clarifying questions, paraphrasing to ensure understanding, and reflecting back the speaker's emotions and intentions. 8. Seeking Silence Amidst the Noise In the midst of our bustling lives filled with constant stimulation and distractions, the Stoic practice of seeking silence offers a profound opportunity for introspection, clarity, and personal growth. Silence in this context isn't merely the absence of noise, but a deliberate choice to disconnect from external influences and reconnect with our inner selves. Imagine a moment of true silence, a tranquil retreat from the cacophony of everyday life. It's in these quiet interludes that we can confront our thoughts, reflect on our experiences, and gain insight into our emotions and aspirations. The Stoic philosopher Seneca aptly noted, we suffer more often in imagination than in reality. This insight underscores the importance of finding moments of silence to quiet the mind and dispel unnecessary anxieties. Seeking silence is not about escaping reality, but about creating space for deep reflection and contemplation. It allows us to sift through our thoughts, discern meaningful insights, and make informed decisions. In today's hyper-connected world, where notifications vie for our attention and digital screens dominate our waking hours, the practice of seeking silence is a radical act of self-care and mindfulness. Moreover, silence provides a sanctuary where we can confront our fears, acknowledge our vulnerabilities, and cultivate resilience. It offers a canvas for creative inspiration allowing ideas to germinate and solutions to emerge organically. The Stoic philosopher Marcus Aurelius reflected, the happiness of your life depends upon the quality of your thoughts. In the silence of introspection, we have the opportunity to nurture positive thoughts and cultivate a mindset that fosters personal fulfillment and growth. 9. The Value of Diverse Interactions one of life's greatest privileges is the opportunity to engage with a diverse array of people from different backgrounds, cultures, and perspectives. Each individual brings a unique set of experiences, knowledge, and insights that enrich our understanding of the world. The Stoics recognized the profound impact of diverse interactions on our intelligence and personal growth, emphasizing the value of learning from others to broaden our horizons. 
Imagine a world where every conversation is an opportunity to learn something new. A chance to glimpse into someone else's life, understand their challenges, and appreciate their perspectives. This is the essence of embracing diverse interactions. It's about stepping outside of our comfort zones, engaging with individuals whose experiences differ from our own, and opening ourselves up to new ways of thinking and being. The Stoic philosopher Seneca wisely advised, associate with people who are likely to improve you. This guidance encourages us to seek out relationships and interactions that challenge us intellectually, emotionally, and spiritually. It's not just about surrounding ourselves with experts or mentors, but about recognizing that every person we meet has something valuable to offer. Whether it's a fresh insight, a different cultural perspective, or a profound life lesson. In today's interconnected world, opportunities for diverse interactions abound. Whether it's through conversations with colleagues at work, interactions with neighbors in our community, or connections forged through social media and online platforms, each encounter presents a chance to expand our understanding and empathy. Moreover, diverse interactions foster empathy and compassion by exposing us to the realities and struggles of others. When we listen attentively to someone's story, share in their joys and sorrows, and seek to understand their perspective, we cultivate deeper connections and build bridges of empathy across cultural and social divides. 10. Cultivating curiosity over judgment. In our fast-paced world, filled with opinions and instant reactions, cultivating curiosity over judgment emerges as a profound stoic principle for enhancing intelligence and understanding. Rather than hastily forming judgments based on superficial impressions or preconceived notions, Stoicism teaches us to approach life with an open mind and a genuine thirst for knowledge. Imagine a scenario where instead of dismissing unfamiliar ideas or perspectives, we pause to inquire and explore. This shift from judgment to curiosity opens doors to deeper insights, new perspectives, and unexpected discoveries. It invites us to question our assumptions, challenge our beliefs, and embrace the richness of diverse viewpoints. The Stoic philosopher Epictetus aptly captured this sentiment. It is impossible for a person to begin to learn what he thinks he already knows. This wisdom reminds us that true learning begins with humility, a willingness to admit that there is always more to discover and understand. Cultivating curiosity involves actively seeking out opportunities to learn and grow. It's about asking questions, seeking clarification, and engaging in meaningful conversations. When we approach life with curiosity, we foster a mindset of continuous learning and growth. Every encounter becomes an opportunity to expand our knowledge, deepen our understanding, and enrich our lives. Moreover, curiosity sparks creativity and innovation. It encourages us to explore new ideas, experiment with different approaches, and push the boundaries of what is known and possible. By embracing curiosity, we not only expand our intellectual horizons, but also cultivate resilience and adaptability in the face of challenges. Conclusion. The stoic principles we've explored provide a transformative path to enhancing intelligence and wisdom. By embracing change, discomfort, and deliberate disengagement, we cultivate resilience and clarity. Lifelong learning, gratitude, and mindful observation deepen our understanding of the world. While active listening, seeking silence, and engaging with diverse perspectives enrich our intellect. Curiosity over judgment fuels continual growth and innovation. If you're passionate about personal growth and expanding your understanding of Stoic philosophy, hit the subscribe button and join us on this journey of discovery. Together, let's continue exploring how ancient wisdom can empower us to live more purposefully and intelligently in the modern world. Don't miss out on future insights and practical tips. Subscribe now and let's grow together.